With eight games remaining in the regular season, if Ohio basketball is going to make a move up the max standings, the time to turn it around is Tuesday night. The Bobcats host Eastern Michigan. I'm Russ Eisenstein, and our preview of Game 23 is brought to you by the Athens County Convention and Visitors Bureau. The Cats are 11 and 11 and 3 and 7, and the Eagles are 10 and 13 and 4 and 6. Ohio's lost three in a row, in which it hasn't scored more than 60 in either of those games. Shooting's been a big reason why. When they shoot well, they win. When they don't, they don't. From three in the losing streak, Ohio is 16 for 66, 24%. On Saturday, the Bobcats lost at Miami 79-59. At the same time, Eastern beat Northern Illinois 59-47 in Ypsilanti. Head coach Rob Murphy's crew was predicted to win the West, but after going 2-1 to start league play, the Eagles haven't been flying as high, just 2-5 in the league games that have followed. Guard Paul Jackson leads them in scoring with 14 points per game. That's 19th in the back. In the post, James Thompson is still doing what James Thompson does, and that's get a double-double. He averages 10 points and 10 boards. The versatile Elijah Mini also averages double figures with 13. The Eagles play with emotion, and that's always a game-by-game -game proposition. Ohio won the only meeting last year at their convocation center, and that was an emotional 72-66 victory. Tuesday night's even bigger for Ohio. Three of the final four games of the month are on the road. The game's on ESPN Plus, and the Ohio Sports Network from Learfield IMG College hits the air at 6.30 with a tip at 7. It's Ohio and Eastern Michigan, and our game preview is brought to you by the Athens County Convention and Visitors Bureau on the web at AthensOhio.com. For Zach Roberts, I'm Russ Eisenstein, and this is Bobcat TV.